what the f I just wish the emulator they had this stuff working right. Ooh, clean, crisp so far in this menu. You control everything since you're first player. I just sit here and let you do it. I'd rather give you first and let you do it all. Kind of exhausted. Two player. Dude, I'd get a, I'd get this game just to have. I have this in my game room. I remember playing this when I was 12 in the arcade. I was like 11 or 12. Played the crap out of it. Super Saturday. There was a there was a thing you can do where you did something and you got the this car. Yeah. Oh, you double tap gas too, and your car does a wheelie. You remember that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, when you're double. Oh, gas is A? What? You want me to make the game louder? Pause it. I'll make it louder. Kind of quiet. Guess mixer. Uh, which one is it? Cruising World? Or just this? We go 15 and then all tenor. Go better. There's like a secret area you could go to with this, too. Steering's not damn, steering's kind of loose. What did you, what'd you do that for? I remember what we all used to do is just slam the gas pedal in the arcade. Like, you honestly just keep doing this over and over. <laughs> Steering feel fine for you? A little loose feeling. This actually plays good on uh, emulator. I'd love to have a steering wheel for this. Be need to just play all your racing. Hmm. Uh, two player only on console, I think. Four player in the arc arcade. The one I played in the arcade, it was only a one player version of it. The, the arcade I played in. And for Daytona USA, it was two-player version where they're connected. But then you see on the internet everywhere, they have like four-player and eight-player versions of the Daytona USA. I never played on those. Oh, I forgot you could change the music. That is wrecked. Yeah. So me or you, that's you. Be K, be kind. Oh, I gotta go all the way right, I can't get a left. your car view out or something weird. Game's actually still too quiet for some reason. The other game was super loud. Oh yeah, I forgot, you get, as soon as I saw you do it, I was like, yeah, you can do backflips. I keep going two wheels because I'm turning while I try to boost. The same as you're doing. <laughs> oh, you can steer while you're doing the wheelie, can't you? It, you it's harder to turn, like sharp turns. 
So you should actually do the boost and hold the direction of the turn, go faster on the turn. And I'm bad at it. Oh, you can jump cars too if you boost. You can wheelie right in front of the car and jump it. You gotta remember, you're playing on a hundred plus ping too. It's hard. It's hard steering. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's why I'm using D-pad. Analog's too hard to steer with. Nah, you do do. Oh crap! Start. Selects the item. I have to go to the end. It's good, it's like instant. On oh, what? Yeah, the new games, yeah, it makes complete sense. My old games are, you're just playing the game, you're not actually waiting, there's never any downtime. I don't think there's like really many loading times in uh, Nintendo based games. Should we can test it? I had, and I think it was Hang Time '99, so when I used to own, it's kind of like blocky based characters. They weren't really smooth looking, but the game was fun. It's like a very cool perspective of how you actually shot the ball and stuff. My grandpa got it for me for Christmas one year when I used to own it. No, it's like the basketball game I had on here wasn't like NBA Jam in the arcade. It was actually like. A more modern basketball game. We can do it after this race if you want to do it. We can switch. Play a bunch of games. Just play for like 15 or 20 minutes in each one. And just keep switching. Once I find a game I really want to play, I'll just stick to it and play it for like 8 hours. Uh. You need to start just streaming on Twitch and just stream every N64 game. Every day, just play one game. For a year. <laughs> no, every day you just like play. Or say you play. Play one game an hour. You play a game for an hour and then switch. And that way you get through like eight, eight games in a day if you stream for eight hours. Okay. Just to test them out. Like, 30 minutes of gameplay just to like cycle through them all. I like to try to beat every game, but I don't get the time to do that. And plus, I don't make revenue doing it, so it wouldn't affect me at all. Like when. Yeah, basically. They don't have to play though, they just stand there and they're just like, give me, send me, send me, donate. What? Oh, sounds like... Yours? Doesn't make sense. You wouldn't get that much on Chatterbait if they were on that site. Yeah, I, f I feel like a lot of their viewers are honestly like uh, paid bots. Like they go to a website and get uh, those packages that boost their viewers and their followers because uh, remember I showed you that one person that was doing the slots and stuff they had like 500 viewers and they had not one person chatting and they were streaming for 10 minutes it was something like that it said it's like come on no chat 500 viewers or it's like 800 somewhere around there what Hmm? No, we're not in a Discord. We're just in a... We're in a chat. Alright. No, you're... I don't... I don't have audio for Discord.